Hi all, and thanks again for joining me in my learning journey. As a reminder, T2L Academy is an initiative I started with the mission of teaching to learn. So I learn and then share and teach with others so that I can learn better and hopefully in the process help others too. So today I'm going to be sharing my learning on this problem from the AMC8 test. So this is taken from the 2019 question paper. It's problem number four. So the topics, the topics that this question covers is perimeter, perimeter, area, and my solution to this also is about the Pythagorean theorem. So uh, let's read through our problem. Quadrilateral ABCD is a rhombus with perimeter 52 meters. The length of diagonal AC is 24 meters. What is the area in square meters of rhombus A, B, C, D? So I encourage you to go ahead, take a minute, try this on your own, and then come back and hit play whenever you're ready. So I'm assuming you've given it a go. Let's get started. So they're saying that the length of A, C, that's this diagonal right here, is 24 meters and if the and we know with the rhombus that each of the sides are going to be equal in in length so each side if the perimeter is 52 that means each side will have to be 13 because with rhombus with a rhombus all four sides are the same in length so each of these is 13, 13, 13, 13. And so what I did to solve this problem is I went ahead and broke this into four right triangles by splitting this down here. And since this perfectly, this line BD, diagonal BD of an unknown length or X, it bisects AC perfectly. So that means either side of the X diagonal of BD right there is 12, 12 meters. So I'm gonna go ahead and draw this out. So let's just take one of these triangles as an example. So here. I'm going to go ahead and draw that. So based on this information, we know that your hypotenuse is 13. Because if, if you look at this, it's a right triangle. So the hypotenuse is 13. It's also telling us that the one of the legs is 12. And here we can use the Pythagorean theorem to find out the length of diagonal BD. And then we can find the area so we have the length of the hypotenuse and the length of one of the legs so the pythagorean theorem is a squared plus b squared equals c squared and we know a so 12 squared plus b squared equals 13 squared 13 squared or 144 plus b squared equals 169, subtract 144 from both sides, you get 25 on this side, b squared on this side. So 5 is equal to b. So now we have the height of this. We know that is 5. So the length of your x diagonal right here has to be 10 because it's perfectly bisected by AC. So 
It's five on either side of your AC line. And the formula for finding the area of a rhombus is diagonal one, one times diagonal two divided by two. And we have our two diagonals now. We know that BD, go ahead and write this out, BD equals 10. And we also know that AC equals 24. So we multiply those two, multiply 24 times 10, and we get 240 divided by 2 is equal to 120, and that is our final answer. So in this AMC8 test, we would circle D. So that's it for this video. Thanks again for joining me in my learning journey. I'll really appreciate it if you leave your comments, feedback, and further suggestions for additional learnings below. And as always, please subscribe and click for notifications so that you can join me on my learning journey and be lifelong learners to make this a more powerful journey for all.